Um, give me some recall on that one. Oh, you lost we five in a row. There's been a stretch six. when you've lost five in a one row. Five. Yeah, yeah, touchdown or less. And there's you're right now in a stretch of losing four in a row in that situation. But you've also been on the good end of that. So yeah. do you do you see some? Is there a tangible or is anything yeah, you can yeah, measure? It's not the details and, you know, making plays. I mean, it's just it's pretty simple. I'll go back. I mean, our first 20 games, you know, we, we were you know, we were working at it, but we weren't real good. And in 06, I've said this publicly, you know, we were, we were in a shutdown mode. You know, we we were not a good team that last six games, which is more puzzling because we were five and one going mm -hmm. into that that stretch, and uh, yeah, we we had a six game moratorium for whatever reason, and that's that's my responsibility. So, you know, that's the deal. And yeah, you, know, you go back uh, if you want to talk about Michigan State. Uh, you know, we turned it over I believe four times, and uh, you know, two years ago, '08. So. Lost by three points. That's kind of the story of that game. So I mean, you know, anytime you lose a close game, you can go back and say this, this, and this. And the challenge is to, to win more of those than you lose of those those situations. You know, whether it be turnovers, third down conversions, those kinds of things, things that win or lose games for you. And the better you do at that, the more apt you are to be successful. Yeah, you know, we, we didn't do that Saturday. Based upon the review of the small things that maybe you did. One, I'm going to on John one. One, one thing that was interesting Saturday, and we didn't turn it over yet, you know, mm -hmm. but there were other things that we, you know, that balance that out. So, but that, that's that's one in losing, basically, if you're competitive. Now, the years we haven't been competitive, you know, it doesn't matter. And in 06, we just didn't play uh, with an attitude that deserved uh, winning. So, you know, if you don't do that, well, so I can go out there. And we did that a couple times, so, you know, that's coaching there. Yeah, I'm sorry. Sorry, coach. Um, based upon the things you saw in the film, the small things maybe you didn't do this week, do you feel that the majority of those are correctable because you still have? Yeah, I, I feel like we can win any game on our schedule. I think we can lose any of them. So it's just, you know, it's kind of how I felt back in September, and things haven't changed a lot. And yeah, we've had some injuries, but so so is everybody else. So that, that's that's part of football. And, uh, you know, the teams that play through the situations the best are the ones that come out on top, and uh, the teams that don't, you know, don't. So it's uh, that's how it works. Do you have any moves left on special teams? I know you've thrown everybody out there yeah, you possibly yeah, can. Yeah, I mean, you know, you're never done totally, but uh, you know, we'll see what happens. Personnel-wise, not nothing really dramatic, but I mean, you know, we're, we're going to tinker and try to, uh, you know, position guys as best we can, at least in our estimation, and uh, then hopefully get you know, develop consistency. And that, that's kind of where we're lacking right now. I think is consistency. It's Adrian on kick coverage. Just kidding. Just yeah, probably. That's a safe bet. How many, how many of those mistakes do you attribute to inexperience versus maybe out of position scheme? Oh, uh, you know, on Saturday we had both. We had uh, some inexperienced mistakes, and we had some veteran guys that, that you know that made some critical errors too. And that's you know that, that's the part where we, you know I like to, to minimize those because you know you're not counting on that going in. Uh, but you know they have lots of things too, so you know wasn't counting on that. And all those things add up, and you know we got to do a better job. In, inexperienced ones you're gonna have you have to live with you know I mean uh, and I, I'm not singling out Don Shumpert but he was offsides on that kickoff well you know it's his second game ever you know, I'm, not, I'm not too upset with him and probably the only thing I'm upset there is that you know on the next play he was very tentative because as you might imagine he was afraid of you know being too aggressive so uh, but that that's you know the second game performance he'll be better this week and, you know he's gonna still be out there I can assure you that he's, he's a good football player <clears throat> Coach Claiborne was pretty visually upset after the 